I want to I want to hone in a little bit more because you you do provide a measure of hope. And for those who have not come to meet you today, uh, un, until today, uh, please forgive me. I have to call you Doc. I, I just I want to call you by your first name, but do, Doc. Call I, me Doc. Doc. Okay, all right. Marty, I think with, with all whatever. due respect, uh, Marty, I have to call you Doc. So so Doc, when it comes to hope. That can be very challenging if someone has been put in a position of isolation. Oh, yeah. Their family members have been cut off. Their friends have been cut off. The, the narcissistic abuser starts to tell them, well, you can't trust that person. You see your, your sibling is that way, or you see your friend is not really, your friend came on to me, or da 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 You know, they start putting them in, putting this person in a corner so they can abuse them and use them. Yes. When it comes to hope, though, you're saying and through your writings, in your anthology of books, you're saying there is hope, though. And, and at, at one point, I'd like to, you know, I, and I want to be very careful about saying what I'm about to say. But, but I think it's important. If I didn't think it was important, I would just let it go. But I, I also am an adult child of alienation. Wow. And... I sort of knew that happened with one parent to another and then the, the other parent to the other. Um, and it wasn't really like, I, I'm, I think in a couple of weeks I turned 60. So it's not until my 60s that I am realizing what? that um, one of my parents wasn't, was the bigger alienator and, uh, and that the other parent you know, struggled and struggled for years and, you know, died of natural causes, but, you know, definitely a broken heart because of the abuse that that person suffered. And because of the time in history, they didn't have podcasts like this, or they didn't have um, support and networks and groups and uh, that they could talk to. So when they were isolated, they were yeah, really isolated. Yeah. yeah. And so they didn't have, so that's another reason for speaking out because we can now 